Hey everyone, this is Aprajita from Excel Champs. In today's video, we will learn how to calculate the average of top 5 values in a given set of data. So in this video, we will use a combination of two formulas, large and average, and we will calculate the average of top 5 values in our data set. Now, first of all, we have 20 products in column A and we have the sales number in column B. Now, first of all, in order to use the combination of our two functions, we need to understand what are these two functions separately and what do they do? Now, the first function is large function. So when I use this large function on this data set, the syntax is array and k which means we need to define the nth value which we need to calculate. Now let's make it very simple. For example, here my array will be the set of values comma. Now I need the first highest value that is the largest number from my selected data. So I will press one and enter. Now this has given me 1998. Now let's cross check this. So when I apply this filter and I sort it largest to smallest, so 1998 is my highest number. Similarly, when I change this 1 to 2, it will give me 1962 because the second largest number is 1962. Similarly, try with the third largest number. So I am changing my 2 to 3. So it has given me the third largest number which is 1943. So this is what the large function does. It gives me the nth largest value from my data. Now the second function is average. Now this is most commonly used function. Now if I use average and select my data set, so it is going to give me the average of my 20 numbers, which is 1588.588 rounding off. Now when I select these 20 numbers, it has given me the average of 1588.85. Similarly, I can customize this to a few numbers. Let's say I need to calculate the average of my any 5 numbers. Let's say from here to these 5 numbers and I press enter. So it gives me the average of these numbers here. Which is 1807.6. So this is what the average function does. Now we will use the combination of both the functions to get the average of my top five values. First of all, I will use the large function in this my data set. Now here I will define the nth value as five since I need my five top five values. So I will use this brackets and now this formula will be surrounded by average this and I'll press enter. Now this has given me the average of my top five numbers. Now let's cross check this data. I'll again go th to this filter and sort this from largest to smallest. Now these are my top five numbers and its average is 1950.4. So it has given me the exact value and this is pretty much correct. So I hope you like this video. Please don't forget to like, comment and share this video. Thank you for watching.